Hello, Professor Red Shoes here, and uh, today I'm going to talk about a microphone called the SM7. Not the SM57, good microphone, but that's not what I'm talking about. Today, it's the Shure SM7. It's a broadcast mic, but I found it to be uh, quite the secret weapon in uh, battling vocals. Wonderful mic. Um, here, let me do a close-up for you. Okay. So this is the SM7. It's a large diaphragm microphone, much bigger than uh, conventional microphones. And uh, it is a broadcast microphone. It's hung uh, properly uh, for studio work. Um, very good, very good. And I've tried it on uh, many a vocalist, and it's been the preferred mic when I've done a mic shootout on uh, different microphones for vocals, this has been the one that everybody picks on. Now, it ships with another uh, windsock. I happen to call them uh, mic condoms. And you take off the other one. I'm just forcing this on. But this other mic condom goes on because you got to practice safe miking. And... Uh, with or without, with a, a windscreen, a pop filter, or the one that comes with it, it uh, suppresses the popping peas, um, that sort of thing. Um, I can't say enough about this mic. I really don't EQ the mic when I'm doing vocals. Just flat sounds fine. The other thing I want to mention about this microphone is, if you do any reading about uh, microphones used in the industry, this was the particular mic that was used on the Michael Jackson uh, Thriller album. Uh, the vocals were tracked with the SM7. Uh, this microphone, 300, 400 bucks tops, and uh, yes, more expensive than regular dynamic microphones, but if you need a good vocal microphone, this is the microphone uh, to have. Um, it has a screw on uh, nut for easily putting it onto the stand so you're not spinning the mic and uh, it has a cap on the back if you remove the cap there's settings for uh, low pass filter that sort of thing um, so right out of the box you're ready to go and very successful in recording vocals okay so here's something else I want to tell you what I like to do is, I like to go to the liquor store and get a large bottle of Crown Royal, drink the whole bottle so I'm drunk as a monkey, throw the bottle away, and then I take the bag and I cover my microphones with these bags. Yes, I've drank a few bottles. And this protects the mic, keeps it clean. You know, you've got to protect your investment. Um... I suppose you could use a sock, whatever you want, but uh, it's a pretty good deal to have to drink Crown Raw. So, there you go. I'm Professor Red Shoes, and we'll see you on another uh, chat about uh, equipment. Bye now.